Stevenson gets the 88-51 win over Clark Summit in the first night of the Buffalo Wild Wings Classic. Glenn Clark here with Coach Gary Stewart. Coach, uh, you guys came out, made a statement early, and sort of outside of a, a sort of short stretch there late in the first half, you really never let up. I think you have to be pleased with your effort. Yeah, I am. I am. We, uh, we had to clean up a lot of things um, and, and credit our guys. Uh, we uh, guard the ball better um, tonight, and I thought we had much more um, – energy and, and much more focus uh, played through their run in the first half got a, a huge basket from uh, Marlin at the end of the half to close the half out and and um, uh, you know the first one's a tough one to get so I'm, I'm proud of our guys you mentioned Marlin he was kind of a highlight machine between that bomb at the end of the first half and then his sort of flying tip in there in the second half a uh, pretty fun night for him. It was and and we needed everything that he brought um, obviously uh, not playing with Evan. Um, yeah, Johnny was excellent too. Uh, uh, I thought those two guys against uh, full court pressure for 40 minutes handled themselves well. We talked last week about Mark getting off to a good start but then getting into foul trouble and what could have been if he had been able to avoid the foul trouble. Well, is that the example that we saw tonight of what could have been and what we think could be coming for Mark every night if he doesn't end up in foul trouble? Uh, no question. Um, he's a load down there. And uh, we did a good job of getting in the ball and, and he uh, got some great deep position. He'll probably tell you that uh, those three jumpers that he missed are, are shots he should have made too. But uh, uh, he's, a, uh, he's a guy that you have to account for in every possession. And um, um, he's going to get to the point where he commands a double team. So our guys are going to get to play against air. And, and uh, uh, when that happens, I, I think we'll take off offensively. And then the guys that get in in the second half, and I guess we'll start with Bo Wesley, who ended up getting 10 points off the bench. But all of those guys that get – those first moments in their career to get on the floor and to contribute that way. I know that feels good for everybody, but it's really important because you might be counting on some of those guys as the year goes along. It is. Uh, they're critical minutes, and um, it's tough for a guy that's um, used to playing in high school and used to starting, and now all of a sudden you're sitting over there for uh, 25 or 30 minutes and your name's called and you're expected to play well um, and, and certainly um, add the, their first game um, collegiately. I thought they all did well. Now you have a quick turnaround for a game tomorrow afternoon again at 4 o'clock against an FDU Florham team that looked good tonight. They did. They did. Uh, we'll have our hands full. They uh, uh, execute. They spread you out. Um, they're pretty aggressive on the interior. Um, and uh, uh, they can they can create some problems because the, um, of their space. You know, they've got four guys that all can make a shot. They can put the ball on the floor. So they're going to be a difficult guard. We're looking forward to it. Coach, congratulations on a great first win and a great first night of a great event. Thank you, Glenn. Coach Gary Stewart, I'm Glenn Clark. This is GoMustangSports.com.